Hello, Tim Gerard, and I am here with Dr. Ian Smith, the Extreme Fat Smash Diet. You've seen him on VH1 Celebrity Fit Club, and he looks just like this. So if you get a chance to meet Dr. Smith, just kind of, you know, wink and a nod kind of thing. Uh, let's, can, can I ask you about the Celebrity Fit Club, just Absolutely. real quick, because I, I want to get back to the, to the book. Uh, but I want to the, the big burning question for me is, did you know that Brat was that pretty underneath all that hip-hop gear? Oh, man, let me tell you something. We had asked Brat for a long time, Brat, please come to the scale one week with like a nice dress, really nice ladylike clothing. She kept saying, no, Dr. Ian, that's not my image, not my image. So she said, I got a surprise for you. So on the finale, the very last show, after she had lost about 28, 29 pounds, right. she came, and let me tell you something, Harvey, the drill sergeant, I had to mop up his drool. He, <laughs> he was all over her. She was beautiful. Wasn't she beautiful? Yes, she was. And everywhere I go now, people say, man, I didn't know the brat looked so good. Yep. She just, you know, she's been hiding herself with the baggy jeans yep. and the chains and the stuff, but she's a beautiful girl. And you know what? She has a beautiful heart, too. Yeah. You had to hold the drill sergeant back in another episode, oh, that man. whole Dustin Diamond thing. You know what? Because you know what? You can't disrespect people. Yeah. It's okay to disagree civilly, but Dustin Diamond crossed the line. He disrespected Harvey. Now, what he said to Harvey, you guys didn't even hear because we couldn't play it. It wasn't right. even playable, but he had disrespected him, and I, and. You know, I had I held Harvey back not because I wanted to, by the way, but because I, but because I love Harvey. I don't want Harvey to get in trouble legally. Right. But trust me, I wanted Harvey to do his business on Dustin Man. Diamond. Man, <laughs> I was watching. I was going, dude, you signed up for this thing. What are you talking about? Why are you mad? So. He, he was he was a nightmare. He was doing it for attention. He decided, I guess, coming into the show that he was going to be opposite of everyone. And you know, you know what it proved? He came in last place by not following the program. Yeah. And, you know, see you later. So, and, and he had the opportunity to do it for free. Now he has to go buy the book, Extreme Fat Smash. Uh, so let's let's kind of get into it. You have uh, uh, recipes in the book. Right. Um, are there exercises in here, too? Because we talked about diet and exercise as a way to maintain your target weight. Sure. So the book has seventy five more than 75 recipes, more than 60 snacks. It gives you a daily meal plan of how many meals you should eat and what they should be. It also gives you what kind of exercise you should do and the length of exercise. How many meals should you eat? I've heard five. I've heard three. At least four. Up to six. And the reason why, we used to say three, by the way. Our grandparents taught us that. Right. But what we learned is that the more meals you eat that are smaller, the less weight you'll gain and the more metabolism, your metabolism will kick up. This is what the French do, by the way, and the Europeans. They eat all day, but they eat small amounts of food. So it prevents them from eating a lot of the junk food because they're not that hungry in between meals because they know in the next two hours they're going to be eating again. So what I'm trying to instill in people, and by the way, there's medical research now that shows that that's the best way to do it as far as weight loss. Eat four to five meals a day, space them about two to three hours apart, and have your snacks in between and... You're on your road, on the road to weight loss. What about uh, water versus energy drinks or, or sports drinks? Because uh, energy drinks is a whole different yeah, category. Yeah. But water versus sports drinks. You have to be careful of even the water. There's some waters, I won't mention any names, any brand names. There's some waters that position themselves as being very healthy. But if you look at what the ingredients are, there are a lot of artificial sweeteners in there. There are a lot of synthetic sugars. And they have a lot of calories. So look at the, and, and they'll say 50 calories per serving. Yet the bottle will have two and a half servings. Right. That's 150 calories. That's a lot of calories for water. That's the same as Coke. Yeah. I mean, what's the difference in drinking soda? You know, you think you're drinking a healthy water and you're really drinking as many calories as you would be in a regular soda. So watch that and you have to be very careful. But the key is, you know, if you drink between six to eight glasses of water a day, that is good for two reasons. One, it keeps you hydrated. Right. And two, it helps cleans out your kidney. What about tap water? Tap water is fine. This whole idea of you have to drink bottled water is really all about marketing, selling bottled water. Right. Most studies show that in some cases the tap water is even better than the bottled water. So, wow. you know, most tap water in the country is absolutely fine. All right. That's Dr. Ian Smith. You can tell he knows what he's talking about. Um, do you still uh, spend time on The View as their medical advisor? I still go on The View and hope to go on now. They got maybe two new hosts, they say. Yeah, I hear Whoopi's coming. So Whoopi and Sherry Shepard, they say, are the two going to be the two new hosts. So That's I look awesome. forward to working with them. That's awesome. I love Whoopi Goldberg. And then um, are, is is there and are you are going to be on a new ce- a season of Celebrity Fit Club? We are going to be shooting season six, believe it or not, in about a couple of months. We don't know who the celebrities are, but I've been told, and it has been confirmed, I've been told that there's going to be a little change, a little tweak to the show. So okay. we look six forward to bringing seasons. that to you. Wow. I know, a long time on reality TV, isn't yeah. it? But people love it. I love doing it. And you know what? The celebrities lose a lot of weight, and what I'm learning is... 
the viewers are losing weight right along with them. So let's keep going. That's beautiful. Also, don't forget about the 50 million pound challenge. Sign up at 50 million pounds dot com. Five zero, pa- five zero million pounds dot com. That's right. All right. We'll have a link up on our website as well uh, because we want you to take advantage of all. Th- this is all free. All free. Um, so we want to make sure you get a chance to take advantage of it. Also, go to the bookstore, uh, any of your local bookstores and get the extreme fat smashed item. I'm holding in front of our camera again. That's what it looks mm-hmm. like. That's Dr. Ian Smith. Thank you so much for coming by today. My pleasure being here. Thank you. That was incredible. Thank you. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Thank you. That was nice.